you, Roger. You know, I think, man, I think I know most, if not all of you. And as you know, I, as Roger said, I work at the Linda Hall Library, and one of the uh, great pleasures of working at the library has been working with and getting to know Roger and Vivian, who I understand will be here she will. a little later. So it's, a, it's an honor to have the book launch of Rainy Day Books, and you can just see some of the authors they had around here. Now I'm one of them. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, authors have gotten their start here. About 21 years ago, we started with Susie Orman and did her very first event. And only about you 15 are. people <laughs> showed up. Nobody well, knew who she was. Go figure. But look at her now. Yeah. And then, you know, we talk about, if you look at some of these named authors, signature posters and stuff like that, and John Irving, John Grisham, people like that, they all talk about how hard it was to get their first book published. And so I'm so proud that he stuck with it. And that, you know, there's, there's, there's a little bit of sort of like resistance at first, but then you sort of like tough it out and just keep going for it. And, and you've succeeded and you've got your book. And so we're so pleased to be selling it. I didn't have any rejections. Oh, great. The first publisher. No, that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> had several rejections. It took about two years to find, uh, that's normal. find the publisher, Blank Slate Press. It was just a great fit. Yeah. It's an amateur sleuth mystery. My intention going into it was to write a a fun book just something you know a quick uh entertaining read that um you know it's nothing heavy it's not you know, not a lot you know of course there's a murder in it there has to be for eventually but you know not a lot of violence and i wanted to also talk about the philippines there are very you know the philippines and the u.s have had such a uh, close shared history for over a century now, but there are very few American author books that are set in the Philippines, and even fewer mysteries, and even fewer yet uh, mysteries set at Subic Bay in the Philippines, the former base. I 